My name is Chris Hirsch. Oh, uh, Chris. So, why Taiwan? I chose Taiwan because I already speak a little bit of Chinese, so I thought it would be a good opportunity to uh, practice that, enhance that, and then I also actually have extended family that live in Singapore. So since Taiwan's pretty close to Singapore, I can visit during like Chinese New Year, Christmas, things like that. Uh, why Shane? Um, Shane has a really good reputation underneath Saxon Court, of course. Um, I, I heard about the training opportunity that I would get before I actually jump into the uh, teaching, and since I don't have any teaching experience under my belt, I thought that would be a good opportunity that a lot of other uh, corp corporations don't offer. Okay. Uh, what were your thoughts of the recruitment process? Ooh, the recruitment process was very in-depth. Uh, going into it, all the interviews warned me like right off the bat what I would experience in terms of uh, hotel accommodations, what the uh, training would be like, um, what to expect from the schools, whether it was franchise DTU. It was very in-depth and I felt very prepared going into it. Okay. Um, what advice would you offer to anyone wanting to work on Move Abroad? Ooh. First thing I would say is it's very important to learn at least a little bit of the native language because even if you intend to be working at school a majority of the time, have a bubble of friends that can speak English, there will always be opportunities where you do encounter people that speak the native language and only the native language, so it's very important to know some of that. Okay, so as you're a newbie, uh, what are you looking forward to most about being in the classroom? Oof. Um, I think I'm looking really forward to building a relationship with my students. Um, I know that a lot of times the students end up uh, going up levels, advancing, and they end up staying within the program two, three, four years, if not more. And then I just, observing other teachers, I see the relationship they have with their students, and they're very close. And, and it's a very unique relationship that you only have with a student-teacher, and I think that's something that I really want to have. Okay. What do you think of the initial training? It was very in-depth. Uh, Considering it was only a week long, it covered a lot of information, but I never felt rushed at all during the whole process. It was very uh, in-depth, and I felt like everything was touched on. If I had any questions, I didn't feel like they were pushed to the side. They were answered very, very clearly. Uh, what are you hoping to achieve with Shane and Taiwan? Um, I'm hoping to get a lot more teaching experience, um, and I really hope that this can become like uh, kind of a life pursuit for me, a passion, um, and I feel like I can really accomplish that within Shane because I feel like I'm surrounded by like-minded people that I wouldn't have anywhere else. Okay, and this one these are you. Say something in Chinese. Uh, let's see. Uh, 大家好, 我叫, Liu Mingwei, uh, 这是台湾. Oh, that's great, cheers. <laughs> that's great, thank awesome. you so much. Oh, wicked.